And speaking of fertility, over 7 million couples struggle getting pregnant each and every year. No, absolutely. And women take the brunt of this, especially with women working longer before having babies. We're always worried about, you know, do, can we still get pregnant? And so a lot of times you can take a lot of over-the-counter things to determine if you're still fertile or really if, you're, if you have a good ovarian reserve. So what we do is we look at hormones. So there's ovulation kits to tell you the timing. Um, then there's actually fertility reserve tests. You can actually get a blood test from your doctor too. A new one's called the anti-malarian hormone that you can get, which is the best one. But really, if you're having any difficulties, you need to go to your doctor. But what women have to remember is 30% of the time, it's a male factor. Now, there is a new home test for you guys, right? Where you guys can actually check out your sperm and see the sperm count. So if you make a deposit, in here, mm -hmm. and there's a lot of sperm in there. So you just take a small sample using this plunger, get that plunger going, it'll actually be pulled up into here like a sieve. You put it in this solution, just like so, mm -hmm. and then you mix it up, and then all you do, you take one of these test strips, and you place six drops <clears throat> on the test strip here. And then as you can see here, the control should turn that color. And then if, the, if there's a line that comes across that test line there in the T position, that means you have 20 million mm -hmm. per milliliter or more, which 90% of fertile men will have. If, you're, if you know that your wife doesn't have any issues and you do this test and everything looks okay, that you still need to potentially get further testing. But exactly. this is something at home you could try. And, uh, you're and again, I think right. sperm count is a good thing for guys to get checked um, and morphology as well because there's a lot of medical conditions that can actually affect um, sperm count that can be, you know, reversed or actually can be very important. Um, things that can happen with the, the prostate, um, you know, hormone levels, a whole bunch mm -hmm. of things, varicoceles, a lot of things that can affect um, what's going on with the sperm that can, you know, be medical problems that men need to take care of. Laptop too long on your groin area, mm -hmm. hot tub, mm -hmm. prolonged period in a hot tub can temporarily decrease your certain, certain medications. medications. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I, I read it's too tight.